Today in this video, I am going to show you some of the great uh, combination of serif and sans serif typefaces and we are going to look at few free typefaces that are not Google typefaces, two of them and other are actually Google combinations I just created for you guys. So uh, I am going to show you uh, this uh, sample screen or header uh, which I have designed. So uh, make sure you download this source file, source file uh, which I am going to include in this video. Uh, along with all the links uh, to the fonts that I have used over here. So I'm not going to include the Google fonts, but the fonts that are other than Google fonts. So let's get started. Now, uh, the first screen, first I am going to show you the first typeface combination is actually IBM Plex Sans and Serif. So IBM actually uh, have uh, Serif font and also IBM Plex have sans serif too. So they are actually uh, the perfect combination because they are made for each other. So if you see a uh, serif or sans serif combination that is actually the same typeface and they have uh, they will have similar you can say features like you can see over here. Now if you look closely you can see that the G over here in this serif font uh, or typeface is actually the same as uh, over here. So you can see this G is same. So we have two story G and they have a similar features like this simple ear uh, on the top over here. So you can see this is actually how they are going to work perfectly. Uh, now moving on to the next combination which I really love is Vol Volcorn and Leto. So these are both Google fonts. So if I show you closely you can see how well actually they works so, so this is actually Lato over here and this is actually Volcon and uh, I, I really love how different strokes and different curves uh, of this uh, Volcon uh, typeface and let me show you one more usage so uh, this actually is not a perfect example of how actually you are going to use these typefaces let me show you one more Okay, so here is a website called comicastays.com and they are using the same combination. This is actually uh, Volcon and this is actually uh, Leto. So uh, this is actually, I found it over here. This is a type inspiration website. I use type.io and you can see over here Volcon and Leto in action together. Actually, I didn't um, use this one for inspiration. Actually, I created the combination and when I searched for them, I found this link. So you can see uh, this looks really great. You can see over here, they are looking uh, perfect together. You can see over here, this is actually Volcon. And here we have this uh, uh, Lato used on this button. So this is a very perfect combination. You can see how the atmosphere of this whole is set up because uh, these uh, serif typefaces, they are going to be more tilting towards um, uh, you can say style a uh, bit stylish and bit elegant so that is actually what we are looking over here so you can see this is actually a travel life um, website so moving on to the next one let's move on to the next one okay so we have pt sans and libertinous serif so we have PT Sans as our Sans font over here, uh, which is used over here. And this is another one uh, which is available on Font Squirrel as a free font. And I really love this one. So this combination uh, is one of my favorite combinations. This is actually PT Sans and Lib Liber Libertinus Serif. Let me show you where it is actually. This is Li Libertinus Serif font. And if we go to license, it is open font license SIL. So you can use it uh, as you like. And it has a lot of variations. You can see over here, we have regular, we have semi bold, we have bold, we have uh, display and different other types. Okay. So this is one of my favorite combination. Then we are going to move on to the next one, which I really love. Uh, this is actually another font which is a free font this is called Remena let me show you where you can download it from I'm going to include the link you can see this is Remena 
and uh, this is actually the their source typefaces.temperstate.net and you can download light regular bold and it's a free font you can download it and uh, you can use it now uh, here i have used it with asap so asap is a bit um, you can say not very um, you can say uh, it is it is a bit of uh, uh, a curvy font it is it has endings or uh, the edges are not very you know uh, very sharp so it is a perfect match for this one so this is actually sharp edges uh, a lot of sharp edges and this is not sharp so we are actually finding contrast in both of them so this is another combination Rema and uh, Remena and ASAP then we are again going towards Google typefaces Crimson Pro and Nonito so let's um, zoom in a bit let's hide this one so you can see it properly Crimson Pro and Nonito. So let me show you how it actually feels and looks. So this is how actually this um, Crimson Pro uh, typeface from Google and uh, it is a free typeface. And also we have the second one which is uh, Nonito. So Nonito has a very rounded shapes, not very edgy. So um, now we are having some common personality between both of them. So you can see it is also a bit fat and have some rounded, uh, rounded things to it like this I, like this R, the this uh, ending of the R. Then we have a lot of different uh, features where we have some rounded, rounded uh, edges in this uh, typeface. Similarly, we have this one. So it is basically a sans, a sans serif typeface but it has some similarities with this one. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. This is DM Sans and DM Serif. This is another new, uh, you can say, typeface by Google Fonts. And I haven't, I haven't seen a lot of people using it, but they are a great match. We have both of them uh, in Serif and Sans Serif. So you can use this combination, DM Sans and DM Serif. Then we have this Noto Serif and Noto Sans. This is another one. They are made for each other. Uh, a bit of blocky, uh, a bit uh, in the vertical direction, a bit taller font typeface. And it is going to look great on smaller devices too because it's a bit taller. Okay, so next moving on, this is a new font which is called Times Newer Roman. It is not Times New Roman. And I'm using it with Roboto right now. You can see it is looking perfect with Roboto. And I really love this font. This is uh, a great typeface. So let me see if I can find it somewhere. Times Newer Roman. So you can download it from here, timesnewerroman.com. And uh, it is actually designed for modern era it is based on Times New Roman. So this is Times New Roman and this is Times New Roman. So it is a bit of, you can say, modern version of the same font, but I love using it. So you can use it too, because I don't want, you know, to have you using everything old or uh, right now we are in a digital era. We are building devices and designs for digital devices which is a bit different from print era. Okay, so here we have another typeface combination. It is the same typeface times New Roman, but it is with uh, San Francisco typeface, which is uh, Apple's or Mac's new typeface. So it is working perfectly with both of them, or with Roboto and with uh, Sans, uh, San, San Francisco text or San Francisco. Okay, so we have very old combination, Druid Sans and Serif. They are made for each other. They look great. They look a bit of serious to me, but I think this is another combination you can use. Then we have another one, which I really like Martel. Martel plus Nonito Sans. So here we have another one. Here we have Martel, which is a bit, um, you can see a taller typeface. You can see we have uh, the X height, a larger X height over here. And uh, if you are interested in typography, I have a whole uh, course, uh, video course, like five or six hours on it. And if you want to improve it, you can find the link in the description below. 
to all my different courses and you can see these both typefaces look great with each other so this is martel and Nonito sans uh, one more thing is that martel has another heavy typeface over here but i didn't use it because i think that it it feels a lot heavier to me uh, in this situation so i think that using uh, extra bold was enough in this technology product because uh, it uh, we don't want it to you know have too much weight over here so this looks great and uh, if you have any questions or any queries or anything you want you can download this file and uh, i'm going to include the link and uh, few of my favorites were this volcron and leto this PT Sans, Labartinus uh, Serif, then this uh, Times Newer Roman with Roboto. Then we have this one. This is also great. Ramena uh, plus ASAP. Crimson Text with Donito was also great. Martel with Donito Sans was also great. And uh, DM and DM Sans and Serif. This was a new combination and this looks also very sleek and very uh, useful. Okay, so this is all for this video. If you uh, have learned something new from this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, don't forget to click on the bell icon so you can get all the updates. I will keep on making more videos uh, using Adobe XD because uh, right now it is available to a lot of people as it is, it's free and uh, a lot of people can use it on both Windows and Mac. So uh, that is all. If you have any comments, you want more videos like this, keep on, uh, you know, uh, keep on commenting and asking me for more videos. I will keep on making more videos. Right now, these are 10 plus combinations. I think 11 uh, different combinations of sans serif and serif fonts. Uh, some are Google, some are not Google. So let's meet you in the next video soon. Till then, take care and bye.